Hi, I'm Rose, and today we're making egg roe in a bow. Before we get started, let's take a quick pic of your ingredients. Okay, so for our sauce, we're going to start with 1 4th cup of low sodium soy sauce in a small bowl. Next, we're going to add 1 tablespoon of sesame seed oil. Now, this stuff is pretty stinky, but it makes a big difference in the taste. 1 tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce. 1 tablespoon of sriracha sauce, which will give it a little bit of a kick. 1 tablespoon of brown sugar. You want to go ahead and give it a mix and then set aside. Okay, now we want to start chopping three green onions. Next, we want to add our ground beef to a pan. We're going to go ahead and break this up and then start browning our meat. If you have a little bit of fat, you can go ahead and drain it in your sink. Once your meat is brown, we're going to add our cabbage slaw. You can find these 12 ounce bags at the store. They come with cabbage, carrots, and broccoli already in them. If not, you can just chop up your veggies and pour whatever you like in there. Now I'm just going to give this a quick mix. And I'm also going to be adding just a little bit of pink salt. And you don't want to add too much because we do have our soy sauce. And you want to add just a little bit of pepper as well. Now we want to go ahead and add our sauce mix that we made. Now I'm going to start adding some beef broth. I would say probably between half a cup to a cup of beef broth. It really all depends on how much meat you have in your pan. I just want to build a little bit of sauce underneath so that I can uh, let it simmer for a few minutes. And you probably need about this much right here. If you don't have any beef broth, you can just add water. Let's go ahead and cover this up. We want to go ahead and switch our heat to low and let it simmer for seven minutes. It's been seven minutes. I'm going to go ahead and add our green onions. Now I'm going to add some sesame seeds. These are optional. And I'm going to continue cooking for just one minute. All right, once it's ready, we're going to add a bed of white rice to a bowl. Then add our delicious egg roll mix on top. For an extra kick, you can add a little more sriracha sauce and top it off with some sesame seeds. I hope you enjoy it. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe.